Hi everyone, Grace from Manta Mat. Quick update on Dory. Okay, she's still very shy and very fearful. Okay, she if she can, she wants to hide in the crate all day long. She doesn't want to come out. She's very scared. Um, <clears throat> have a neighbor run there and she's just freaking out. Okay. Uh, she's doing better on following instead of bolting and trying to run away. Uh, oh, there's another puppy at the front, so I'm gonna take a detour. Come on, good girl. Very good girl. Um, so that's that, and then uh, I probably will have another video actually talk about fearful dog. A lot of people don't understand, feel like, oh my god, you're so abused the dog because dog is screaming, uh, dog is very shy, and then you should not push the dog. But here's the thing. You don't push them some of some of them never get better never okay I have uh, um, clients that have dogs for five six seven years only getting worse they only contact me when their dog actually beat somebody or they couldn't coping with the situation anymore and it's so all the root problem is the dogs very shy and fearful and we do need to do a lot of work there's a lot of patient a lot of um, consistent uh, and a lot of confidence in yourself to believe that okay you do need to push your dog a little bit to help her or him get better every single day okay so this is Dory um, she's introduced to remote color several days ago and then um, also paired with prong color today it's been past couple days I've been just sleep lead with the remote color um, prong color will help her like boost confidence for the next to the next level uh, if you don't believe it well you haven't get the trainer who can do it right for you or you didn't go through the heels actually make that work for you okay uh, I'm not saying you have to use it but it's a great tool anyhow just quick updates on Dory she works much better now okay talk to you guys soon happy new year